Hi everyone. Welcome back to another exciting lesson. I am Susan, I will be taking you through today's lesson on levers. What is a lever? A lever is a simple machine made of a rigid beam, and a fulcrum. The effort and load are applied to either end of the beam. The fulcrum is the point on which the beam pivots. Let me quickly run through these three important terms for your better understanding. Load is the object you are lifting. Fulcrum is the point at which the lever pivots. The effort is the force applied to the object to be moved. When an effort is applied to one end of the lever, a load is applied at the other end of the lever. There are three classes of the lever. A first class lever has the fulcrum in between the effort and the load. You push down on one end, and the other raises up. If the fulcrum is in the middle, the lever doesn't let you lift anything heavier than you could normally lift. So there is no mechanical advantage, I have used a new word here, mechanical advantage. What is the mechanical advantage? Mechanical advantage refers to how much a simple machine multiplies an applied force. The farther the effort is away from the fulcrum, the easier it is to move the load. The examples of first class levers are scissors, pliers, and a crowbar. In second class of lever the load is in between the fulcrum and the effort. The best examples of second class lever are wheelbarrow, bottle opener and a nutcracker. In class 3 lever the effort happens between the load and the fulcrum. Examples of class 3 lever are hammer, brake and hockey stick. This was all about three different types of levers. Hope the information given in this lesson will help you to explore more about simple machines. If you have not subscribed to our channel, please subscribe, like and press the bell icon to get update on new lessons.